Mr. Eugene Phillips, I thank you very much for introducing me this evening as the recipient of this first Champion of Communications Award. You know, I shared with your chairman, Nate Pope, that I'd really prefer to be there in person with the impressive awardees. Mr. Eric Holder, the former U.S. Attorney General, the newly elected president of the American Bar Association, Ms. Paulette Brown, and my longtime friend, the international motivational speaker, the Reverend Dr. Willie Jolly. But the start of the NFL season has me traveling pretty aggressively right now. You know, I thank the Lord for this honor and am humbled to be recognized as such by an organization, Concerned Black Men National Organization, that for nearly 40 years has provided academic, motivational, and economic support to young people, a passion of mine, and best practices programs to young people and parents alike. Your track record has been stellar in giving of yourselves to strengthen the fabric of our communities across this country. And I certainly hope that in some small way, I've played a role in helping that cause because the example of love that Concerned Black Men National Organization has shown to me is best stated in scripture. In Ephesians chapter four, verse 16, and paraphrase it says, as each part, meaning us, does its own special work it helps the other parts grow so that the whole body, our national community, is healthy and growing and full of love because the most powerful four-letter word in our vocabulary is love. Again, I thank you so very much and God bless all of you.